Well, another team meeting took place across town in Noble. It's where the Chickasha football team was scheduled to play tonight. In light of Cody's death, school leaders are on both sides canceled their games. And tonight, the Noble football team shared their condolences for Chickasha with our Colleen Chen. It is not the game they expected to play. Not the game anyone expected. It scares you, honestly. The Noble Bears were supposed to take on the Fighting Chicks under Friday Night Lights, but news that 16-year-old Chickasha lineman Cody Turner died Friday morning changed everything. It's difficult. It's uncharted territory for me. So. The Bears and their coach, Stephen Barrett, scrimmaged instead. Thoughts of Cody Turner and the opposing team's pain stood on the field with them. It wasn't our player, but I know we all feel really bad for them, their whole community. I love the game of football, but... Obviously, in this situation, you know, it's an opportunity for us to, to teach you know, these young men that some things in life are more important than football. For a lot of these guys, it's the first time for this kind of lesson. They've soaked it in. Don't take anything for granted. That's something Noble Principal Frank Solomon, who broke Cody's passing and the canceled game to his team, knows about. Well, the hardest thing in life is to lose a child. Uh, unfortunately, my wife and I have lost a child also, so... We'll be willing to do anything and everything uh, in our prayers to go with them. Here's what I want you to do. Number one, let's keep Chick Shay in your prayers. Very sad day, and our uh, hearts and uh, prayers go out to Chick Shay. Colleen Chin reporting for us. Funeral arrangements for Cody Turner are pending. We do know there's been a fund set up for Cody's family at Chickasha 